hi guys welcome to my channel again uh, so this review is uh, mainly for the vive ui which will you know produce in a6000 so i have the a6000 with me let's increase the brightness a little bit okay so here you can see the all new latest Vive UI. Uh, Lenovo do something with the Vive UI. They cut um, some features of the Vive UI, which uh, which already there in the Vive X2. Uh, they cut some features. Uh, so uh, you can already go back to the Google Now launcher anytime. In the home settings, you can select the Google Now launcher. But first thing you have to do, you have to download the Google Now launcher from the Google Play Store. And then in the developer option, uh, in the Vive X2, you have the uh, back to uh, clean UI or back to the stock Android. This device, uh, this device doesn't support this. And the UI is pretty good. You can see many more customization. You can uh, change the wallpaper like this. You can swipe left to right to change the wallpaper, or you can also swipe right to left for the previous wallpaper. You can also replace or change the place of the widgets uh, this device also support widgets uh, this device have two gesture you have you can uh, pull uh, up to left you can pull this type to uh, see the notification and also you can see the max notification but but the icon are too small in the notification i said and another thing uh, i can see that uh, you can swipe uh, below down for the theme menu you, here you have the theme menu you have the theme option you can select the theme already this device comes with two theme but there is no uh, no market for the uh, supply theme and you also have the add button you can add uh, you can add this widgets to this page and here is the all the widgets you can add you can already you, if you want to add the music widgets then you have to select this and place it there you have to select this and place it there and you already have a uh, lots more shortcut digital digital uh, radio digital uh, clock etc you also like this you can from this way you can add the widgets and you also change the screen manager if you go to screen manager you can select how much screen you want uh, maximum you have nine home screen max to max and you can delete them like very easily and this device also support the two finger gesture it's also worked perfectly So you can see the weather widget on the top and uh, the all the icon are in the launcher because this device doesn't soft, uh, doesn't have any menu button and here is uh, some more option like wallpaper you can change the wallpaper you can change the desktop wallpaper from this wallpaper you can easily set the wallpaper like this and you can also change some settings uh, on tweaks uh, and you can go to the desktop setting you can select wallpaper scrolling swipe to change wallpaper desktop animation you can change the desktop animation like this we change it to like this you can easily change it you can customize your uh, desktop as much as you can want if you go to settings there you can have the full settings option and also in the desktop settings you also have more settings option we can uh, you can ch check it here the auto arrange icon and desktop gesture setting you have three gestures scroll up scroll down and double tap gesture these three gestures are also come with this Lenovo a6000 so this is the ui of the new Lenovo a6000 which is basically called the vibe ui thanks for watching guys this is Shovik Mitro signing off i'm gonna quickly back with the more gaming and other any others review pretty soon so thanks for watching